It's day one. It's about 1.30. Just finished lunch. And it's hot. Actually, the breeze is the one thing. It's the only thing that's saving me right now. We put this together in a few days. The designs, they were approved, and we built the, uh, the suit in about uh, 10 days. We kind of took a the traditional spacesuit design and uh, made some additions to it. This is a Bridgestone special. Take some pressure off him. He's still too neutral. Just always remember, if you have to, if you're going somewhere, yeah. just put your hand out. Because yep. we have you completely. Yep. If you start feeling like you're falling, just put your hand down to touch something, and you'll just stop. Yeah. But when they've got like 90% of the weight, sometimes like you're jumping off of rock A, thinking that you're going to B, and you end up at C. You want to wipe out your eyes? Get some of that dust off my face. I'm not sure these guys have actually stolen tires. These are not professionals. It'd be done in five minutes. Right. For less. When we were tracking vehicle behind, I was getting the tracking vehicle to sort of slam on the brakes, and the, and the, the other yeah. ones to accelerate away. Just sort of sudden, the buggy decided it wasn't four-wheel drive, kind of got stuck. We're just taking reference for the 3D guys, just in case we need to uh, fill in any sort of wider shots of the buggy. We'll be creating the actual guys in CG. One of the exciting, exciting things for me as uh, the passenger is I know that Mike has the same visibility that I do, and right now, as soon as the helmet goes on, the way the lens is convex, I have double vision. These drivers are insane. And they're wearing astronauts. Nobody got mowed over. <laughs> Knock on wood. You know, it seems like we should have learned the first time that it gets stuck in that soft dirt or gravel. Last shot of the day. Uh, we're about to wrap it all up, and that's it. Hot item. <laughs>